I think I'm losing my mind Trying to stay inside the lines It's like I want it in play Okay, Valentine's Day is coming up and I have a question for you. Will you be our Valentine? <laughs> Surprise my girl with the bubble bath for Valentine's Day. What the hell? Whoa, damn your girl so fine, but her breath is like Whoa. She says she wanna dance, but she don't know how to Whoa. Welcome back, all you painters out there to the joy of painting. I'm Bob Ross. Valentine's Day is right around the corner, so I figured we'd get in the holiday mood. Well, son of a gun. A flawless transition. Let's look at her colors. Marigold. Purple like Barney the Dinosaur, red five standing by, light black, and dark white. Let's take some of this uh, Barney purple and make a happy little sky. And now we'll add some uh, red five standing by. And lastly, we'll add some merry gold at the bottom. What we need now are some fun little clouds that just float around and have fun all day. This is Charlie and that's Bernard. They're friends of mine. And you know what I love? Big tall mountains, of course. <laughs> Don't mind me. I'm just adding some fit the, fit the, fit the halo blue. Now if the mountains get thirsty, they have something to drink. And because this is my world, I made some pink little trees. What? Are you gonna ask me to be your valentine? Ava, I'm literally married. Uh, but you watch me! It's my job! Please! Fine. Get yourself some strawberries and do not remove the hair. Take them and give them a little shower, you know what I'm saying? Get them nice and clean. Now we're gonna pretend like we're the TSA and pat each strawberry down until they're nice and dry. Alright, swag, now let our strawberries vibe out on the side while we prepare our chocolates. If you're using chocolate chips or wafers, you could just toss them into a bowl. But if you're using bars, all you gotta do is cut them into little pieces. All this does is to ensure that the chocolate melts easier, I think. I don't fucking know, I'm not a chef. We're gonna microwave these. This is what my chocolate is seeing. Alright, cool, they should be melted after about one or two minutes. Take your strawberry, put it into the chocolate and then onto a parchment paper lined baking tray and just repeat until you run out of strawberries after about 15 minutes or the chocolate outside gets hard remelt the chocolate in the bowl and just drizzle all over our strawberries like so y'all gotta put some respect on my name let's go the more i look at them the uglier they get i don't know we're gonna refrigerate these for about 30 minutes i took a shower and got ready for school and when i was done they're all ready to eat <laughs> If you're on a diet, I don't recommend you make these though because I probably ate like 20 by accident. Happy Valentine's Day. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. Bye.
guys, my name's Jill, and today I went crazy and made this Valentine's Day cake. But you know what's even crazier? I didn't make chocolate cake for once, I actually made red velvet, but of course I still took it out of the oven with my bare hands, so don't even worry, nothing's changed. Okay, anyway, so I leveled off all my cakes, and then I stacked them up with some of this vanilla bean buttercream, then I crumb coated the whole thing in this thin layer of buttercream, popped the baby in the fridge, took it back out, and then I coated it in this thicker layer of buttercream, I whipped out my handy dandy cake comb, and I made all these fun little stripes in the cake, popped the baby in the freezer for a long time, well, it was freezing. I made these fun little ombre buttercream colors from like this light pink to this reddish color. I filled in all the crevasses, as Heber would say. Then I smoothed the whole thing out and I had these fun little like ombre striped sort of things. Then I made some of this chocolate ganache for the sides. Drip that down. Hashtag drip too hard. Ew. Okay, then I used all my leftover frosting to make this frosting sausage. And then I made all these little stars with that frosting on top. And then I had my final cake and I ate a lot of it and it was a fun time. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye. Happy Valentine's Day. Here's how to make the ultimate Valentine's gift. Chocolate, flowers, card, red wine, perfume, one tea bag. Blend. Put it into a nice bag. That's how to make the ultimate Valentine's gift. Oh, it's dripping. Happy Valentine's Day. Is this? That's right. It's all the clothes I've borrowed from you while we've been together. I was looking for this one. There's more. My hoodies! Yeah, I just thought I looked cuter in them. Rip! I also really liked your dog. Just be sure to take care of her.